Hello guys, Barry here. I have brought a major update to the UMG Typewriter Effects Pro with lots of new features, but still easy to use. Let's check it out. The first new feature is that you can stop it at any time during typing. The second is that you can skip it at any time and display the final defect directly. Next, let me introduce another new feature that may surprise you. Reverse function. Regardless of forward or reverse punctuation and space time are counted, so let's give it a little time to delete rich images. At the same time, you may also notice another new feature. The sound effect is different when backspace. Of course, this can be also customized. Stop and skip are available for backspace. They work just as well. Setting up is not much different from the previous version. Let me show you the example in the demo folder. I added four buttons and a rich text block to the canvas. I also create four custom events. When I press the button, it calls the corresponding event. And connect this custom event to the corresponding node. For the in text, you can use literal text or use a variable. One of these two parameters controls the number of words each time, and the other controls the speed of typing. Set the rich text with the alt text. Text blocks are similar to this. The remaining output nodes are used similarly to timeline. They can be used for some advanced purpose. Here are the big difference from uh, previous versions. You can set to spread sound effects, one for forward and uh, one for reverse. If you want to use rich text and rich images, make sure set the rich text set and the rich image set here. They must be the same as you set them in the rich text block. Otherwise, input text and images will be output as text. If what you input and what you want to output is just uh, text, do not worry, just leave them empty. Another important point is that for nodes connected to events cannot be left empty. Something must be connected to them. I have put the predator alien language translator from the previous tutorial in the new version and updated the example to show an advanced usage. To see this, just open the showcase map blueprint and change the vintage class to alien language translator, then run the level. Okay, that's all for the update. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and like if you like my video. If you have any questions, please leave a comment. See you next time.